Anything guys, just had a report of the block drain. So we're just gonna check these manholes. Now I do get repeated blockages here because I think there's issues with the manholes themselves. Launching. And if you have a look down there, oh yeah, so there's the branch line they get blocked up on. Normally this manhole gets filled up because that catches there, builds up in here, and sometimes even builds in the main line down here as well. So you've got some back up there. So I'll just remove that manhole. And it's all PVC downstream of this. It looks pretty clear on that section. Let's go check this other manhole which backs up as well sometimes. Looks like we got an issue down here as well. If you have a look there, you see it's all quite that's our outlet there coming into this manhole. And that goes through the council line and just over this little berm there's a uh, council manhole. So that's obviously got some issues down here as well. So I'm just working out what we might do is just clean that top end so I can be out of the way of vehicles coming through here because it's quite a busy unloading area. And then we'll come down and have a little jet up the line here as well. So I'll just put this back together and I'll see you guys at the top there. Alright, it's just a bit busy this morning, especially being a Monday morning. So we've already got the couriers and stuff coming in and out. Wanted to make the deliveries. So I'll get this one cleared first. It's probably literally just going to be plugged up right here. Break one as soon as I put the sound clear. connection clear it's flowing through there now we're going to go down to the bottom end there and try clear that line coming upstream so that way we're out of the way of all the vehicles coming through this car parking area all right i'm gonna wait yep let's carry it it's ready to come out Mr. Manhole. Yeah. Sweet. It's all good, brother. Just want to give us tours a couple of flushes. So we'll just double check, make sure it's coming through there. 
and we know we're 100% clear, but normally blocks up right in this manhole. Yeah, that's the cut off in. The cut off this manhole will fill up as well. Backwash there, it's broken up from our blast. Sweet ass. Beautiful, see how it comes there? And it catches over here for me. So, and then it takes a bit more water for the pain. Thanks, yeah, it's all good, brother. So they can use it again if they want. But they're about to use, they can use everything again. Right. Off. Yeah, so. Did you do one or two flushes? Uh, yeah, so obviously it came, the paper stuck here, and the second flush is what cleared it through. But the, the plumbers asked me to have a look and see what can be done to try and improve, improve all the lines in the manhole. But the other one down there is also a bit blocked up as well, so I'll go down there and clean that down end one as well. It's just. My phone's time to talk to me. All right, sweet. Now it closes up and get out of the courier's way. Sweet. <laughs> All right, and we got to do the bottom one. Sweet. You're good. Thanks, man. All right, that's good. So that's working. The issue is, it'd be nice if it had more manhole space, and so you could bring that around a bit further. Because that's I've been trying to smooth. I'm trying to try and give. A, Smooth it off with an epoxy. We come out. Almost want to cut a bit of this concrete away in here. Bring it a little further before doing the, the turn in. All right. Let me go a photo so I can work that out. It's going to be a bit of a pain. Okay guys, we close this up and we'll go clear that bottom end. All right, I'll see you over there. All right, let's get this one open. Go guys, as you can see. So let's just come and come through there. So we'll just let us get in here, give us a bit of a blast.
between the two manholes is actually all plastic. It's just the manholes themselves are connections that are causing grief. So it's just See how it's all catching on the edges do is show you where this goes. So I'm just going to run some obviously the hose down here. So we worked up there, by those cones, it's plastic in between the two manholes that comes through here. And this is the uh, city main. This was deep. This is around about 12, 14 plus feet deep. Probably closer to 14 or 15 feet in fact. So there you see it's a place a bit of pipe that comes down there. These are roots of the council manhole from the council trees. And there is the water. I've seen a bit of PVC. The top part has been broken off. That's just toilet paper sitting in that over the top there. And that's our connection right there. So we know it's all coming through there and that could I do is a repair it's not a major it doesn't block up over there it's those manholes that we need to sort out mainly so what I might do is right here we drag Just going to rinse that off. Alright, stop the machine. 
So, yeah, that's our connection there. So really, the council needs to clear all these roots out because they will ultimately grow into the connections themselves. So as you see, it's super deep. There's the main. So I'll just put this cap back, um, manhole back on, and then I'll just take some photos over there. So the plumber knows a bit more about the repair that is required. Secured down. So yeah, that's requiring an extensive amount of work. Let me show you. So here is our connection coming into the top, the top section, and what we got is you said the gap there. <coughs> Sorry. So there's a big gap, it's all gets caught there. There's a huge big gap on the sides here. And we'll feel the stone work there. Little concrete though. All this needs to be filled in nice and neat to stop any type of kind of speed catch in here. So there's an epoxy and that gap filled with an epoxy. And just all here as well. Filled with an epoxy as well, throughout that connection there. And that's a big root there, so it's, yeah, so it's a big root there. Try and get rid of that. And fix all this up. I mean, ideally, you'd top all this up and install a new section of plastic through here, but we have root coming in from the council line as well, so it's not going to be much better than epoxy will hopefully help take care of that. There we go. All right. So that is the drain cleared guys, for now, I'll report back to the plumber. So there's quite a few hours worth of um, work there to be done, just to try to smooth those edges off. So beautiful Monday, a little overcast, but nice and warm. So I'll just get this closed up, put some sanitizer down here, around the area, and that'll be the end of this job for today. Great seeing you guys, catch you on the next one.